Well, hello there, YouTubers. Today I'm going to be doing another ramen video. And this ramen video is going to be from the brand that brought you Shin and Shin Black, Nongshim. And this has absolutely no English on it. But that word in Korean says Jinja Jinja which means really really and I'm not sure if it means really really spicy or really really tasty or really really good but it comes with a standard pack of powder whoops I just like dumped it everywhere a sachet of vegetables that you mix on top and this one is interesting because it has little bits of freeze-dried egg in it so that's going to be interesting forgot that I didn't put cord in yet there we go mix that in there some nice onion freeze-dried onion freeze-dried egg so this is supposed to be a pork broth with peanuts and sesames in it. And it did have like a peanutty smell to it when I first made it. So let's go ahead and get into this and see how spicy it is, see how peanutty it is. Noodles have a nice bite to them. There's definitely some spice to it. And you definitely get a, a peanut flavor to it. It's not extremely peanutty, but it doesn't taste like peanut butter. But you definitely get like a peanut oil type of flavor in there. Not too, not too much uh, pork flavor, I would say though. So the main flavors I'm getting is spice and peanut. Now, if you look this up, it's pretty highly rated flavor-wise, um, both on Amazon ratings and different people who rate ramens. It's pretty. It's rated pretty high, usually five out of fives, and I can see why. It's pretty tasty. It has a lot going for it: the spicy, the peanutiness, which is not a flavor you get in a lot of ramens. But overall, it's good. The spice level is about a 6.8 out of 10. Flavor wise, it's pretty interesting. It's not the most delicious ramen I've ever had. But I would go at about an 8 for flavor. So, the Jinja Jinja, really, really ramen from Nong Shim. It's about an eight out of ten. That's what that's what I would say. It's uh, very interesting. The peanut, the peanut is the most interesting thing. Is the spice, plenty of other ramens have spice. The peanut flavor in this is the most interesting part of it. So if you want some something interesting, uh, ramen wise, it has a different flavor profile to it. 
Try the ginger ginger if you want like a peanutty type flavor to your ramen. But uh, until next time, guys. Hope you've enjoyed yourselves. Bye.